Hey guys, it's me, Albert, Plastic Wars 82, and check out the Special Force Military Playset. Actually found these at the 99 Only Cent store, and they were $1.99 the bag. Um, I seen these, and I'm like, all right, cool, let's try them out. I got me three bags, opened one, kept the other two closed up. But as far as I'm seeing these, they look like they're 60 millimeters, maybe? A little bit bigger than a 54 millimeter or 132. And as far as I counted, there's 16 tan and 16 of the green. Um, The scopes are someone they look familiar and some just look newer, I guess. Uh, of course, this one looks like the, the German guy running from the Hing Fat Sets with the big old gun. And no, this one did not come in a tan. I thought it would, but it didn't. And then in the green, you see an officer with a pistol. And I got this one in a tan. And the green binocular guy. The detail on these are okay, not that great, but okay. have this guy running at somebody with a big old gun like the guns from aliens the marine the space marines <laughs> then you have this guy pointing up either shooting someone up or he's hunting or something but there you go And then you have this guy. Of course, we've seen his type of pose before from the American GI set in the Hing Fat. Like walking, just scouting around. And of course, we have your crawling guy, which this one looks like the British crawling guy from Hing Fat with an oversized gun. And of course, I didn't get him in the tan as well. From tan... I guess you could say I got like five of these officer guys with the gun, uh, two binocular guys, a couple of these guys right here. I mean, you know what? Now that I think about it, I got him in tan, but I did not see him in green. Or if I did have him in green, I didn't pay attention that good. So I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I did. I did because I just noticed there was a different, uh, a different pose like this guy right here and I also got him in green sorry I skipped that guy so yeah these two kind of threw me off it's a different type of helmet and different type of gun that they're holding up I mean like I said they look like they could be space marines he looks kind of concerned huh like oh man look at this his facial features I mean, they're, they're, they're cool if you guys are going to go ahead and do a little stop motion picture, the ones that do it, you know. I just didn't get a crawling guy in the tan. Maybe in the other bags there's crawling guys. Um, Other than that, yeah, this is, this is how they come in. They come in this package. Like I said, they were $1.99. You know, and I get excited when I see stuff like that at the 99 cent store or any Dollar Tree store because it's cool. You don't see that anymore. They're just, they're hard to find. You don't see, for some reason, Dollar Tree, it's, they're not selling any more army men as far as from the Dollar Trees I go to. I don't see any more type of tanks or bagged up army men. Um, remember they had like the, the little bag with the tank and the fence and a few soldiers or they even had the police set or the firefighter set. I don't see that anymore. So it's kind of like, man, what's going on with Dollar Tree? 
But other than that, I mean, this was a cool find. I was very happy, very excited. And like I said, they're they're pretty big, comparing them to a like a Marx figure, which I have them here. This is a NPC figure, and the Marx uh, Japanese guy. Yeah, they're huge. They are huge. Oh, they're falling over. They're huge. Look at that. I mean, yeah. So, I mean, like I said, I, I still use them. I'll still use them to fight. These could be the, the freaking, the tan reptile giant guard. Or you could use them as the green reptile commandos or something. <laughs> but there you go. Hope you guys liked the video. And I'm going to post another one in a little bit. I actually found some other cool stuff. Maybe you guys will recognize in a few. Thank you.